45 minutes ago. It's in the area of Winslow and Brentwood. You see here off Old Highway 71, just west or just east of Interstate 40. This is near Brentwood Mountain off Highway 71, Old Highway 71. Our crews are on the scene are telling us they are looking through the area to find this reported crash. Now, this happened about 45 minutes ago. What we have learned is the Fort Smith Regional Airport, also known as Razorback Approach, had, had uh, reported to the Washington County Sheriff's Office a plane that had lost altitude. They were one phone call that was made to the Washington County Sheriff's Office. Another call was made to the Washington County Sheriff's Office about what a witness heard, a, a witness claiming to hear a plane crash in that area. What you're looking at now is video from near where this plane has reportedly gone down. Uh, at this time, nothing has been located. There are a number of helicopters uh, that are circling in that area to try to find this, uh, this airplane that crashed about 45 minutes ago. We're working now to determine how many people were actually on board this airplane. We do know there is also helicopters on standby for medical help. Uh, and they're also in uh, helping out search with in a plane as well, too. Now, from about 45 minutes ago, this is what it sounded like as the call came out from the Washington County Sheriff's Office. Medic for Boston Mountain First Responders and USAR airplane crash, the area of 17677 Brentwood Mountain. We had two callers they, that they heard what they thought was a plane crash west of the residence. Um, that's all the information we have. I'm just going to advise you that I did confirm with Razorback Approach. They were one of the callers. Uh, appears to be from the tail number they had at King Air, possible 12 passenger potential, uh, by number of seats, unknown souls on board, and they were one of the callers. Again, you heard uh, the, the, phone, the two phone calls that came in, one from an eyewitness near where the plane went down. Another call that came in was actually from Razorback Approach out of Fort Smith that saw this airplane lose altitude and then go off the radar near where this accident, this plane crash has reportedly taken place. Again, they are still searching for this plane. It's in the Brit Brentwood Mountain area, which is between Brentwood and Winslow. Uh, just off of Old Highway 71, just east of Interstate 49. Now, we do have crews on the scene right now. This is video that we just got back in from near where this plane went down. We're hoping to get a live report here in just a few seconds uh, from a command center that has actually been set up near where this plane went down. A number of uh, agencies have responded to this, rural fire departments, uh, the Washington County Sheriff's Office, a lot of deputies are out there as well, too. And again, a number of helicopters are in the air right now trying to search or try to find this plane that actually went down. Now, we do have multiple crews on the scene. We'll, of course, continue to update you as the story develops both on air and online. Now, we do have that live shot from the command center. This is uh, from one of our reporters who is out on, in, the, in this area where uh, is this near Brentwood? I believe this, this command center is near Brentwood. Oak Grove Cemetery, this is where this command center has been set up. It's very terrain, as you can imagine, very hilly terrain in that area where this plane supposedly has gone down. Uh, that's why they're having to use helicopters to try to find this. This is actually a command center that has been set up near Oak Grove Cemetery. Uh, and as you can see, a lot of, uh, a lot of agencies have responded to this. A, a number of Washington County deputies are there, uh, Washington County EMS. Uh, several rural fire departments are out there to try to help find this and and when they do find this plane uh, to, to offer up some uh, medical care uh, to those who may be on board that plane. We don't know uh, how many were on board. As you heard that uh, police call that went out, there is possibly this plane could possibly carry 12. It's a 12 seater airplane. And they but they don't they still don't know or they don't know how many people were actually on board. This now about 45, 50 minutes ago when this plane went down near Brentwood and near Brentwood Mountain between Winslow and Brentwood off old highway 71. 
call went out about 45, 50 minutes ago. One call, and they based it on two phone calls, one from a witness who lives near where this plane supposedly went down. The other phone call came from uh, Razorback Approach, which is the, uh, the tower that's used by smaller aircraft that come into Fort Smith and into uh, to Northwest Arkansas, especially into uh, Drake Field at Fayetteville. Uh, they reported that a, they, they had seen a plane on their radar lose altitude very quickly and then go off the radar scope. And that's what led to two phone calls to the Washington County Sheriff's Office, and that's what led to what you're seeing here. We have lost that, uh, that live report. All right, um, we're going to try to check in with our reporters here uh, in just a few moments. Uh, once we do that, we'll pass along as much information as we can. We do have multiple crews on scene. We'll continue to update you on this, uh, this developing story, both on air and online and especially on our Facebook page. Uh, you can go to our website, 5newsonline.com. We'll have the very latest on the situation that's happening right now, that's unfolding right now in the Brentwood area. Once they uh, find w this, this, this plane that has gone down, we will let you know when that happens. And then if more information comes out between now and four o'clock, we'll, uh, we'll break in as well too with more information and then have a complete uh, team coverage of, what, of this situation coming up this afternoon on your 5 News at 4. For now, we'll send you back to CBS Programming. Thanks for joining us. And oh, we're back live again from the, um, from the command center. This is, uh, this is near the Oak Grove Cemetery. Uh, we, this, is where the, um, this is where police have told us that they will bring us information once they find it. Uh, once they get more information on this. And of course, we'll uh, have that for you as soon as we can on air and online. We're going to leave you with this uh, look from the command center. We'll send you back to CBS programming. Thanks for joining us.